publishing a video isn't the end of your content creation process. It's actually the very beginning. A question I get all the time is how can I get more people to watch my videos? The answer is twofold, to create a really valuable video and to promote more than you create. I say these things to the students in my video bootcamp program all the time. And in this program, we look at specific ways they can promote their videos to their ideal audiences. If you're a creator like I am, it can be hard to take the time to promote your work because you're always thinking about creating more videos. But the promotion part of this equation is so much more important. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. In this video, I'll be sharing some easy ways you or your team can promote your videos so more people see them. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Cheryl Tan, the founder of Master Video Today. It's a community that offers training, accountability, and support for your marketing teams. Subscribe to this channel for weekly video strategies you can use in your business. I would love to hear about your best video promotion strategies. I'm sharing some of mine. What are yours? I would love to hear. Post those tips in the comments below. Before you even sit down to shoot your video, figure out if your topic is something your audience wants to learn more about. Do your clients ask you the same things over and over again? Will your video answer those questions? These videos are informational, educational, and they will help your audience learn something from your knowledge and experience. To come up with the topic for this video as an example, I went looking through my notes. Over the last few months, I've had the opportunity to speak virtually to large groups about video creation and content strategy. And at the end of these presentations, people ask me very specific questions. When I remember, I jot down these questions right after the presentations are over so I can have them at my fingertips when I need video ideas. And as I was looking at several lists, I saw a common theme. People are always asking how to get more views, how to promote their work to get more views, and how to increase engagement. I know right away that there are a number of people who are interested in this very topic. Now that you have a topic that your audience wants to learn more about, in my case, about how to promote video content, then make sure the title is clear. Make sure your audience doesn't have to guess to figure out what your video is about. It's so easy to try to be clever and cute when coming up with titles, but being clear tops the list. If your video talks about five simple ways to promote video content, say that, and the more specific, the better. Whether you're putting the video on YouTube or Facebook or LinkedIn, make sure your audience understands the benefit they'll receive from watching it. That will increase the chance of success with them clicking on the video and continuing to watch until the very end. Make sure your title is clear. Once we do the work of putting together a video from coming up with a topic idea, finding the right outfit, shooting the video, and then editing that video, you may have lost sight of the reason why you created it in the first place. Once you publish your video, remember you already have an audience of people who are interested in watching. So send the links for these videos to those people directly. Let's say you have a large Facebook audience. Upload your video natively to Facebook, meaning you take the video from your phone or desktop and you drag the video directly into Facebook, you publish it, then you'll have a link you can easily share with people, either in comments or direct messages. You can definitely create a system to use social media to share your videos. If you have a Facebook page or a Facebook group, you can use the scheduling function within Facebook to push out the video to your followers and group members. You can also send video through email directly. As part of my process, I create a video every week. I send these videos to my email list and that becomes the piece of content I share weekly with my readers. Maybe you're watching this because you saw a link in an email that I sent you. It's my way of reminding you that it's there with some hopefully really valuable information. By the way, if you'd like to be on that list to get my weekly videos, the link to join my email list is in the description below. And if you sign up, you can get my simple guide that takes you step-by-step -step to get started with your equipment setup, your studio design, and your lighting. And don't forget about the larger organizations you know. Are you a part of an industry organization? Are you a part of a local business alliance? How about a school group, a parents group, or some sort of association? Could your video or a series of your videos help those members? Would connecting to those organizations and being a resource for them help their members out? If you want to show them what you know, you could easily send them a YouTube playlist or a link from one of your social media profiles.
This is the piece we work with closely with our clients to truly build relationships and win clients with video. If you'd like to learn more about how we help our clients, our team would love to talk with you. You can schedule a free consultation at CherylTanMedia.com consultation to learn about our programs and services. One last way to promote your videos is to have someone else talk about your work. Want to get some ideas on how to create shareable testimonial videos? Watch this next.